Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. This is Asad Yaqub and once again I welcome you to my gender training IELTS writing task 1 video and this is the video on letter writing. In this video I'm going to give you some strategies for a wonderful letter, a letter that gives you the maximum band score. Uh, as I told you before nowadays students have a lot of issues with uh, writing they are not getting their required band score even sometimes it surprises me as well that the students they are very good the candidates they have good English but still they fail to get their required band score so that's why I'm making these videos that after watching these videos you will be able to get your required band score and it's just not one video there are around 20-25 videos on letter writing on general training writing task 1 so you must watch all the videos in order to understand the concept of letter writing and how to write a better letter to get maximum band score so let's go on with the writing strategies uh, when you are answering the task 1 question you should work through the following steps now these are basically the steps the guidelines you need to follow to write a good letter the first the first step is analyze the question read the question read it carefully and analyze how many parts are there what is the uh, what is the background info right what are the instruction words what are the bullet points and all that so you need to analyze the question and while analyzing the question you can in underline in circle or anything like that you can do next you can make notes of ideas which could be useful and by the way you can write these notes down on the question paper do not write anything on the answer sheet other than the answer if you want to do any rough work if you want to write some notes you can do that on question paper even you can underline the words on the question paper as well just to make it uh, uh, clear to, uh, to understand for you next you can make a plan and plan is already given by the way the bullet points are there or and if you know the layout of the essay then the plan is already made that I will start with greetings uh, then afterwards I will write the letter the statement of purpose then I write this and that and all that stuff so this is how you can make a plan then you should write the letter once going through three things you should write the letter and after writing you must check for mistakes that's what we call proofreading so this is basically a simple plan to write uh, appropriate letters or to write uh, letters in your examination room and this will not waste your time if you follow this five step formula analyze the question step one step two make notes of ideas which could be useful step three make a plan step four write the letter step five check for mistakes okay now i'm going to share some tips from ielts writing examiners because you know sometimes we the trainers we ielts trainers do not understand how to satisfy the examiner what to write to satisfy the examiner to get good band score so i'm going to give you some tips from examiners and these tips will increase your band score as well when IELTS examiners look at a task one piece of writing, they have three basic questions in mind. What are those three questions? Question number one, does the letter do what the question asks? Is it written according to the question which is given including the bullet points and letter details and situational details and instruction words and all that. So does the letter do what the question asks? That's the first thing. Or is the content the ideas and information appropriate to the task that's the first thing examiner sees in your letter right the second thing that the examiner sees or looks for in your letter that is is the letter written in a well organized and logical way what is well organized way as i told you the parts of the letter logical way means the flow of information should be logical as per the question as per the bullet points and all that then are the language and the tone of the letter accurate and correct so these are the three things if you work out these three things it's a simple three step formula that is going to improve your letter writing skill okay so you should work out these things the first one is does the letter do what the question asks or is the content content means the ideas and information appropriate to the task Number two, is the letter written in a well-organized and logical way? Number three, are the language and the tone of the letter accurate and correct? Once these three things are there, you must be getting three bands out of three. Okay, that's important. Now, 
many candidates uh, get lower bench score in the test because the content and the organization of their writing are not good enough. It is important that you follow these steps when answering in task one question. Uh, now, after this, I'm going to just give you some more steps and they can help you with your question. Uh, they can help you with your letters as well. So don't forget to watch my next video because in the next video, I'm going to give you a five step formula uh, about answering uh, IELTS letter. And I'm going to give you one example letter and then we will just see how to analyze it and what are the five steps to write that letter. Thank you very much. If you like this video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and click the bell icon because if you click the bell icon, you will be the first one to watch my video when you get the notification. I also teach IELTS online. If you want to join my online IELTS classes, my WhatsApp number is given. You can contact me for that. See, sometimes it's cloudy, sometimes it's sunny and my arms are going to be dark very soon because I'm exposed to sunlight and Mustain just uh, warned me, Daddy, your arms are gonna be dark. But I said, okay, I need to make the video and that's important for me. So thank you very much, guys. I'm dedicated towards my profession, towards what I'm doing. This is my cause, this is my passion and you should be dedicated towards your cause and your passion and then you'll get the desired outcome. Asid Yaqub wishes you all the best from Second Cup, Express Highway, Murray. Take good care of yourselves. Allah Hafiz.